What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the YouTube channel, Yonder Vision. I hope you're all well today. So we're in the middle of Air Max month at the moment, so I have to do a review on the Air Max shoe. And I did actually have to wait for this one to come out because it was the only one I actually was interested in. And that is the Nike Air Max one in this blue and sesame colorway. So let's get straight into the details about this shoe. moment there's been a few releases that have caught my eye but I think this is the one that I really want to see in hand out of all of them so far apart from the Air Max one which is releasing this week so let's keep an eye out for that review when it comes to the materials it comes in this corduroy which comes all the way around the shoe even on the swoosh as well in this sesame colorway on the bottom it comes in this sort of sail off white color on the bottom it comes in this all black with like speckled white bits on the bottom Nike have kept it pretty simple they've not gone too crazy about it they do actually remind me of the Sean Wetherspoons if I'm going to be honest with you I feel like this is going to age well it's going to crease nice it's one of them shoes where I definitely have to wear in the summer I can't see myself wearing these any other time of the year but they do look really nice in hand the premium materials they've used on these so shout out Nike when it comes to that when it comes to the fit of these shoes now, these actually do fit like any other Air Max one, so I wouldn't have to worry about that. You could probably even get away with a half size up if you wanted to, so don't even stress when it comes to the sizing of these. These do feel like yeah, normal Air Max one shoes. So just go over your true to size and you'll be absolutely fine. Now when it comes to the price, I paid, I think it was 150. I'm really bad with prices, so please don't kill me. They will probably go for a bit cheaper. I can't see these selling out everywhere. So usually with Air Maxes recently, they release and then two, three weeks later or even a month later, they'll go to hit the sale racks, usually on like sneakers and stuff or something. So just keep an eye out for that. You can use discount codes, whatever, to try and get a discount off. Don't pay full retail. I'm only paying retail so I can get the reviews out. So just, um, yeah, don't rush into buying Air Maxes or anything recently. Just wait for the reductions and you'll get a better price cheaper. Just wait it out and try and get a pair for under retail. But anyway, guys, I've gone over the fit, materials, and the price of this shoe. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a comment, like, and subscribe to the channel if you're new, guys. We're trying to get this thing growing over here. So leave a comment. Leave a comment. Tell me if you like the channel or not. Tell me if you like the content. I'll continue. But anyway, enjoy the rest of your day, guys. Take care.